Alright, we're back for the third episode of this. So I have to go back and talk to Morris. And uh, I hate talking to him because he's kind of a dick. But we're going to kill him eventually and everything's going to be alright. I don't want to go anywhere. Alright, yes. It's like my goal just to, you know, just finish it. Like, I'm hoping he's the bad guy just because I just, just want to... I don't like him. I just want to shoot him in the face. Looks like it's a day, more dayish. I see a little more more of the town now. Looks interesting. I haven't seen any enemies though around or something like that. There might be some in this area somewhere. Yeah, this is a pretty small town. Is like a, no, they got a little general store. That's cool. Probably check that out. But I feel like the mission will lead us there eventually. So, ah, lag, I'm sorry, guys. Every once in a while, I'll just get a lag spike just because. My computer's shitty. Man. Get inside. See, so I gotta do videos so I can save up for a bigger computer, then eventually, a better computer, then everything will be fine. What do you have for me? I'll uh, tell you about the conversation. Yes. It would definitely seem that the old hag is hiding things, but does that truly pertain to the matter at hand? Regardless, I have already learned most of what she told you. Sorry, Aaron Runner. I guess I wasted some of your precious time. In any case, all it really means is that we'll have to rely on someone else for information. I want you to talk to Swath next. He seems to be the only well-educated one here. Try to get him to talk about what the mayor avoided, in particular. Anything related to this town's history or religious beliefs would be useful. Go, and don't come back until you learn something worthwhile. Wow, rude. They're just destroying those coffees. What's wrong with you? Is he just back here, just looking at paperwork where I do all the work? He's looking at the coffee. I don't like them. It's a general store, yay! I was right. Let's see what some. Let's see what good goodies they have. What's up? Is there nothing here. No. Yeah. What goodies do you have? What's up, Save? Ah, a newcomer. I hope you didn't have too much trouble getting here. The woods can be a bit. Well, a bit of unwelcoming sometimes. Well, let me know if you need anything. Okay, uh, what do you have for trade? I just want to look at that real quick. Sure thing. Bunch of rounds, nice. Just simple stuff like, um, guns. It's always weird. The Vegas has so many more guns, I feel like, than Fallout 4 did. You help with anything? Use any help theme? Hmm. Well, it's maybe not too important, but I can think of one thing. If you happen to find any noteworthy books in good condition, then I'll be happy to pay you for them. Hey, I haven't found a book here. Well, would let's be see it, man. Books for Save. Actually, in her mind. Uh, <laughs> you should tell me about yourself. Hmm? Me? Well, I can't say I'm all that interesting. You gotta look for books. These days, I mostly just hide away in the shop and read my books. Books from the pre-war era are very important to me. I've always felt that people should make a better effort to preserve them. Maybe they're burned or ruined constantly. And yet, I grow older every day. I feel as though that every day that passes, the writings of our pre-war ancestors are gradually fading away. I guess, I guess I just can't accept the death of the old world, a world that I, I never got to experience. Uh, sorry, didn't mean to go off on a tangent, but uh, I hope that answered your question. Oh, uh, what else is there? Can you run out of town history? If you think it will be useful, then sure. 
I'll try to sum it up for you. He don't care, just tell everything. The town is very old. Old even by pre war standards. Much of what it was in its pre war days has still survived. This town was heavily steeped in tradition, with a strong emphasis on secrecy and seclusion. Historically, Past residents were known for lashing out at anyone who would threaten their way of life. One major example was when the steel magnate Richard Bronson was fought by the town sorry, trying to something. expand into the Darkwood region. Be sorry. The town's people vehemently opposed it, claiming that it was encroaching upon areas considered to be sacred. Once a steel mill was finally built, its workers faced a constant barrage of harassment and threats. This kept escalating until one day several of the mill's workers died of unknown causes. Shortly after, Bronson silently shut the place down. The town eventually developed a fear-inspiring reputation and became a place that outsiders avoided. Ah, uh, so this is what's happening. Keep in mind, that is all just history now. Whether this is weird tried to the town's religion. So, you heard about that. Yes, Darkwood Falls has always been a religious town, but not for any religion you might be aware of. You see, there are unique places in this region. Places that emanate a strange energy and an otherworldly violent glow. Our ancestors worshipped those places and felt as though there was some kind of special knowledge within them just waiting to be deciphered. Much of the town's traditions were formed around that worship. What would happen to know any of these places are? You might want to try asking Sarah about that. She always been the more religious type than me. Is she the one lady we talked to? You've been very helpful, thanks. No problem at all. Best of luck to you. I hope you can find Molly and Layla. You probably won't. They'll probably be dead. I'm not gonna lie. That's how this. This is how this works. We gotta solve this mystery. Come here. <laughs> you just sprint, dead sprint to your first. Like what the hell? What's up? Have you gotten any closer to finding my husband? You look like you're about to fall asleep. I haven't known any of his secret locations in Darkwood. Oh. So you have been doing your research. I do happen to know of one. I've actually visited this place before, as a girl. Back when our town's religion was still relevant. In the northwest, you'll find a large deadfall. If you climb over it, you'll find what you're looking for. Do looking again, let you a trap. You think my husband could be there? Well, if so, I guess I shouldn't waste your time any longer. Please, find him. Yay! The investigation of the dark dude. That looks like we're going back. We'll talk to dickhead over here. What's up? Morris. What do you have for me? Doesn't worry about the religious history and sacred locations. Can't we just do this ourselves? With a history like that, I can definitely see how the disappearances could have a religious connection. So by all means, go to this place. What's some, like, Wendigo stuff You'll or something You'll have like to that? go alone, however. I need to stay here and keep an eye on everyone. Before you head out, make sure you're armed. It sure wouldn't help things if you went and died on us. Alright. Trial to the dead fall northwest of town. So we're actually gonna get some uh, combat in here. I don't like running with a pistol. I like the little running animation. Yee. Look how fast I am. The game's like, no, don't. Don't run. Lag. <laughs> okay. As far as this away, by the way, game. 
Uh, it's not that far away. Should be there in like two seconds. Oh, first enemy. What's up? Oh shit, we're not that stealthy. Dark bees. Oh yeah, we fought these things earlier. Oh dang, they're strong. Not strong enough. Look, we have like 50,000 stim packs. Run the face. Boom. Boom. Boom again. Oh, these things are strong. I'm going power armor. Um. Was the caravan shotgun good? I don't remember. There's a lot of ammo for it. Let's look what we have in our inventory. Imagine let's use a gauss rifle. Did not mean to use that. We really can't <laughs> maintain stealth here. Because I keep pushing the wrong button. Because I moved my uh, shoot key. And it's right by the sprint key, so. Oh, what's up? I don't know, that doesn't do shit. Oh, there's. Ah! Go away! Oh, we don't have to worry about killing ourselves. We have like so many of those auto injection stuff. Dark beasts are so damn strong. Die, please! Finally. Damn. Strong enemies.